It's becoming increasingly popular amongst leaders in the U.S. Double masking has been seen everywhere from the floor of the Senate to government press briefings. Am I clear? Am I clear? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay, I think I'm wearing a double mask, that's why. <laughs> Sorry. Even the president has done it. And now the United States' top health advisor is recommending more people take up the practice. There's nothing wrong with people wearing two masks. I often myself wear two masks. The U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention advice is to wear one cloth mask made of two or more layers of washable, breathable fabric. And health experts say that while there's currently no strong scientific evidence that double masking is more effective at stopping the spread of COVID-19, common sense suggests it is a good idea. This is the typical surgical mask, you know, that a lot of people wear. Very good thing to have. But oftentimes people wear it, there'll be gaps, you know, along the sides. And then if you put a double mask, like let's say a cloth one over it, what you're doing is you're sealing that a little bit better than if you just, you know, than if you just had this alone. But in the US, mask wearing has become politicized. The previous president chose not to wear one until many months into the pandemic. Polls suggest just two-thirds of adults always wear a mask when leaving the house. And 13 states do not have a mask mandate, requiring them to be worn in public. Health experts say the emergence of new coronavirus variants may be a chance to reinforce the importance of wearing face coverings and even encourage the use of double masking. We're not doing enough genomic testing in, in the U.S. to really know how much of the new variants we have. But if we get that data and it's as disturbing as it's likely to be, then I think it would be worthwhile to come out saying uh, the virus has gotten worse and we need to do more masking. Most people in New York do wear a face covering in public and some are open to adding another. Sometimes I've worn two masks, uh, especially when I know I'm gonna be in a crowded situation. It's a bit of a hassle. I mean, if, you know, if the experts are saying you're good with one mask, I think one mask is just fine. I was like, sure, I'll try it myself. And like, it doesn't feel too bad. It makes me feel safer. I feel it makes other people around me safer. The CDC is now looking at whether to recommend the use of two masks as a tool to fight the pandemic. In the meantime, doctors say for most, one well-fitting mask alone should do the job. Sarah Walton, CGTN, New York.